Hey, namaste. This is Sacred Owl with another rendition of Real Talk by Sacred Owl. Today I want to speak to you about excuses. But before I get deep into it, I'm going to give you a quick story about my son. My 11-year-old son, which I try to raise based on accountability. I try to teach him to be accountable for your actions and to take, deal with the consequences of whatever decision you make. So therefore you are in the moment in this moment dealing with whatever you need to deal with so one day he finally got the you know the teachings and he came home and you know like kids do he made some mistakes and he came home and I asked him very you know directly uh, you have anything to tell me today and he says and very quickly he admitted to the things that he did and he spoke his mind he told me why he did what he did and gave me all the reasons and not one point at one time did I hear any excuse about it he took account for what he did his actions he took and then he and then explained to me why he responded the way he responded well in doing that I, I was swelling up with pride inside of me because even though the action he did was quite you know, 11 year old ish, 11 year ish, you know, 11 year old ish. It still was the fact that he was so conscious and so clear about his actions and what he did to the point that he didn't try to make an excuse about why he did it. He simply said, Yeah, Dad, I did it, and this is why I did it. So at that moment, I said, Where are there any reason why? That? And he know what he said to me. No, Dad, there is no excuse for what I did. I went, wow. He was in the moment, right there present. No accountability for anything, no blaming, no deflecting. He was in the moment. When we make excuses, we start to do something which is called time travel. We time travel to the point in where that excuse was created. And then we're living at that moment of that excuse instead of living in the moment of now. When we make an excuse, we deflect, we push off, we don't, we don't take accountability for our actions, and therefore we put things in, on other people's lap and on other people's shoulders. I know anybody that's in a relationship, I'm sure you've heard your partner give you an excuse, and if you haven't, then you have really a good partner there, and that's great. But you've, I'm sure you've heard excuses from your kids, from your partners, from your co-workers, from your bosses, from people in your life, even your own parents you may have heard excuses from. And the reason you're hearing that is because there at that moment there's an emotional compromise that's going on for them at that moment that does not give them permission or feels, gives them the, the feeling of safety to speak their truth and deal with whatever they dealt with and say what they need to say. We have to learn to understand that so that way we do not get frustrated with people's lack of ability to be accountable for themselves. An excuse is simply a time warp to the past. An excuse is saying, I'm still living at that moment, whether it was five and I'm 40, or I'm 56 and, it was, and I'm 12. That excuse is saying that I'm still 12 at this moment as I'm talking to you because that's where my maturity has stuck, been stuck at. An excuse is a rationale and a reason that says I don't believe in myself strongly enough to admit that I did something and therefore I don't have the courage nor the heart nor the, the tenacity to say hey I own this. Own your things. Stop making excuses. There are no excuses out there. Every choice you make is the consequence of a prior choice, which then brings you to this point. Now, you, you can time lapse to that, and I'm not going to argue that. But what I am going to say to you is that the excuses that you make simply take you and diminish your power at this very moment. At this time frame right now, when you make an excuse, you are now saying, I am not capable of dealing with the action I dealt with right now. I need to deal with it from where I was at. It doesn't matter what you did. It doesn't matter why you did it. Just if somebody you love or care about or wants, you want their opinion, please stop making excuses for why you didn't do something and become accountable. My 11-year-old has the maturity and the accountability of most males that I've encountered, and he's 11. And the reason he's like that is because that's what I'm teaching him. If you ask me, did I do something, I'm going to give you one or two answers. Yes, I did, or can I talk to you about it later privately, or can I talk to you privately about it? Three answers. 
And I will tell you why, what I did and why I did it. But the reality is, is that I'm not making excuses because I'm trying to stay here, right here, right now, in this moment. There are no excuses. Adult up, admit what you did, and be free of the past. Hey guys, God bless. This is Sacred Owl. I love you. With no excuses. Peace.